injuries to Darno that prevented him from playing most of the season. Line in the left center, and the Braves have their first hit. Chased down by Lagaris. Simmons is going to try for two, challenging Lagaris. Murphy with the tag. He got him. Another notch on the belt for Juan Lagaris as he guns down Simmons for the second out. Well, watch him throw the ball. He on the on the just a spin here. Doesn't plant. Just a quick plant and throw. That is a terrific play. And I believe that is his 11th outfield assist. Outfield assist. assist. Yes. One, two. Mm. And Lobaton cranks one. Deep right center field. And Laguerre is Not diving. Makes the catch. A run will score. Franzen goes to third. Added to the highlight reel. It's every day, it seems. I have not seen a young man catch balls and get to balls like this guy. Nice play. He came out of nowhere. When that left the bat, that was absolutely a double. I'm talking about everybody. I'm talking about power hitters, slap hitters, doesn't matter. Odor with a base hit into left center. Pena around third, heading home. Throw to the plate, the tag by Darno. And Pena is out. An assist for Lagaris. The tag by Darno. Inning comes to an end. Pena attempting to score on the Odor base hit. It's been a fun watching him. It'll be interesting to see him get through the eighth. Josh Harrison leads off. Hits one deep to center. Turning around Lagaris. He gets there and runs it down. Well, he turned the wrong way, made the adjustment, and still made it look easy. You know what's interesting for uh, great outfielders, and I include him in this, is that once he goes after this ball, he knows he's turned the wrong way, but he doesn't panic. He turns the right way as soon as he gets his feet, in the, uh, his feet the right way, and then makes the play. He is special. It's two great plays now due to the last inning to start it off with an unassisted play at first base and now the line drive to center field Harrison judicious use of the bullpen is in order line drive base hit charged by Lagaris here comes Ross around third the throw to the plate by Lagaris on a hot buck with a tag he's out Lagaris guns down Ross to keep the game tied the 10th outfield assist of the season for Juan Lagares, a one-hop strike. Well, he's got the strong arm right on target. Can't do it any better than that. Buck gets the tag down, and the Mets escape the bottom of the fifth with a 1-1 tie. Worth hits a dead center field. Lagares back to the warning track near the wall. Lipe. Oh, and he made the catch. What a play. Lagares taking a home run away from Worth. Worth stole a home run last night. Lagares returns the favor. What a spectacular catch by Juan Lagares. This is not the half of it, folks, right there in the replay. It's him. The, the amount of distance he had to run to get there. He is something else. What a club. That was George Foster as a rookie scoring the winning run in the league championship series against the Pirates. As Ludwig gets one up the middle for a base hit. She was going to be waved home. Here's the throw by Lagares on a hop. And Darno puts on the tag. And he is out at the plate. Lagares gets another notch on his belt. Looked like Mark Berry, the third base coach, was trying to hold Chu for a moment, but Chu tries to score on Lagares, and Lagares nails him. Well, Big Juan, most, most importantly, the accuracy of the throw, the one hop, easy for the catcher, but never misses the cutoff, man. And that's also critical. Uh, Ludwig can't advance. Or, or Phillips cannot advance on a throw second to be runners on second and third. 
if the hit overthrows the cutoff, man, those are the little things that win your ball games. And Darno completely taking the plate away from today. Two hits, two walks. Hitting a 309 for the year. Slams one to deep right center field. Racing back Lagaris near the wall, and he makes the catch right up against the fence. Lagaris knew exactly how much room he had, used the entire ballpark right up to the orange line, and takes an extra base and away from McCutcheon to end the top of the first. Now he's losing what? Five straight going into playoffs. Jeanette with the base hit, and they're going to send the runner. Lagaris with the throw on a hop. Centeno makes the tag. Side retired. Two runners thrown out at the plate of the inning, one by Young, and now Lagaris guns down Halton to end the inning. Centeno, a great job to go get it and put on the tag. 15 outfield assists for Juan Lagaris, and that ends the inning. A lot of fun with that one. Ooh. Into right center that'll fall for a base hit. Luke Croy is going to be waved home against Lagaris and the one hop throw to Wrecker and he tags him out. Outfield assist number 14 for Juan Lagaris. And a nice job by Wrecker to make the reaching tag on Luke Croy for the second out. Don't run on that guy.